Peace Tree City firefighters say they were in a race against time to save a teenager caught in floodwaters this past weekend. The dramatic rescue was caught on camera. Fox News Doug Evans talked with the teen and his grateful mother. I'm with 14 year old Vincent Wright and his mother Vanessa at the Line Creek Nature Center in Peachtree City. It's a popular park, beautiful for hiking. A reminder last Saturday that Mother Nature runs things around here. Peachtree City firefighters rescued Vincent from the swift moving floodwaters Saturday evening after he and two friends had decided to go tubing, unaware of the flood warnings. So, what, what was running through your mind with, uh, as you were doing that? It was fun. Fun? Yeah. Didn't turn out that way, did it? No. <laughs> At what point, Vincent, did you know you were in trouble? When I couldn't get across. You, you couldn't get across the yeah. creek? The water is back down now. Vincent shows me where he was standing that night when he got caught and couldn't move. He was on kind of an outcrop of rock and waist-high raging water. The other boys made it to shore, but the wrong step for Vincent, and he might be swept away. Firefighters say when they arrived, they had no idea if the ground beneath Vincent would hold. What they definitely knew was the clock was running out. Besides the flooding, they were also worried about hypothermia. The call came out, and... The rescue had to occur very quickly and was done very quickly. Chief Murphy says his firefighters trained for water rescue, but this was different. They hiked in everything they could think of from the fire truck. The ladder, ropes, and life jackets were all crucial. Look at that current. The chief says he is so proud of his firefighters. If there are textbooks written about this type of rescue, you guys wrote a new chapter the other time. Uh, yes, yeah, the improvised. <laughs> <laughs> chapter is what we wrote. I'm filled with nothing but gratitude for them. I mean, they are absolute heroes. They saved his life. That crew from Station 81 will be back on duty Friday night. The Wright family, as well as the families from the two other boys involved, they plan on bringing them dinner to say thank you once again, this time face to face. I'm Doug Evans, Fox 5 News in Peachtree City.